So 2K decided to release the franchise players of the Heat and the Hawks. So these cards are absolutely insane. The first one that I really badly want is this 89 overall Shaquille O'Neal. He just looks like an absolute beast and would be a beast in this year's 2K because he can just dunk on people like there's no tomorrow. Also, I am in a different position now. It's because I'm in a hotel, so I'm just traveling, but still videos. Sorry about the mic quality. It's just my camera audio. I couldn't bring my mic, but anyway, let's get into it. Also, a really good card is this Glenn Rice. He's got a 93-pointer, and he can also dunk, which is what I look for in a player. With 80 speed, 69 driving dunk, isn't that great, but just a beastly card. So those are really the main two I want to pull, and we're going to do a 21-pack box. Now, they actually have a topper, but they don't say what the topper is, so I, I don't know what it is, but it's a lot more VC than just buying two 10-pack boxes. I think it's kind of a rip-off depending what the topper is. Let's hope it's a good topper though, and let's buy this baby. It's kind of bad this year how quickly it takes to open packs, because when you bought it last year, you would be so you know proud that this is my pack and I'm gonna get good money for this, and we get a bronze player. 69 overall. Yeah, I remember like getting through and you would actually have a lengthy pack opening, but this year it's just opened a few packs and you're done. <laughs> Brook Lopez there, three out of 21. That's a multiple of three, he's 21, but we get a gold player and he is Marvin Williams. That's a historic player, so that could go for maybe 2,000 MT. <laughs> like they don't really go for much, but if you can pull a Ruby or a Sapphire, it's pretty good. All right, what we're hitting up in this next pack, 2K. It's not looking great for me right now. It's a silver player, and it's Aaron Gordon. It's not looking great. We get a gold player, and it is Rudy Gobert. Mid-range Deadeye and Post-Riser badge in that pack, too. That's that's probably the best two badges you can get out of a pack in together, but this is a terrible pack. Uh, come on, 2K. I believe in you. Oh, no. We get a gold again, and who is it? Kenneth Fareed. I believe in you, 2K. I believe you can just slide something good in my, t in my packs. It's a bronze player. Diamond Stone. I talked about him last video because he had a pretty cool name, but please just get out of my packs. All right, let's do this. Let's do this. Um, I, I do not have good luck at all in pack openings. Like, <laughs> I was terrible last year, and it's not looking good this year. Oh, finally. Finally, we get an emerald. Thank you. Let's hope it's a historic one or it's like clay or something. Who is it? It's Udonis Haslam, who's historic, but I don't think he's that good. But I, I'll take anything now. We ain't going back to back, I can tell you that much. As we get a bronze player. <laughs> maybe, maybe again. No, 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 no. Difficult Shots is a very good badge too, so just make sure you guys look out for the badges because some badges can go for like 4,000 MT. We've only got 8 packs to go in this box, can you believe that? Like, it just goes so quickly. Limitless Range is probably the best badge you can get as we get another Historic Player. Alright, let's point up in the sky. I don't... Oh, what? This is my topper. Really? So... You're going to give me the topper halfway through the pack opening? <laughs> oh, what? And that is the worst play you can get as the topper, so shout outs to 2K, thank you. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, just terrible in the next packs. Another bronze. I, I am so unlucky. Still unlucky. I think I'm going to get something good in this pack. I just, I just feel it, you know? Yep, yeah, that's that's good. I'm happy with an emerald. Let's hope it's like an 83 overall. I bet it's an 80. Oh, okay. Carl Anthony Towns is actually really good. He goes for like 6k, and I've already got him on my team, so I really do recommend him if you want a good center. And nothing in the next pack, but we do get two golds and Tyler Scorer. I, I, I haven't even seen that badge, so maybe it's pretty expensive. But of course, out of all the cards in there, we get a bronze. <laughs> So we've only got two packs remaining. I, my boy Tupac, can, can he? No, no, no. He can't, can't get us anything good. We've actually got two packs now. Whoops. So maybe Tupac can rise from the grave and shed so many tears and get me a gold player. And it's Antoine Walker, which is an all right player. I think. I think he can shoot a three. I'm not 100% sure, but I'm, I'm happy with any historic player. So the final pack. 
I can't believe this has just gone like that. I can't believe they did the top of midway through the pack opening. Is this final player here a ruby? That's a bronze, wow. I, I should just never do pack openings. Like, I am so unlucky. Yeah, these are all the duplicates we got. So I got a duplicate cat. I only had two, three emerald pulls that whole video because of the... Um, because of the... Like, I, because of the top where I had another one. I can't even speak. That's how... Like, that's how bad this pack opening was. <laughs> so to be honest with you, if I was to do this pack opening again, I'd probably just get two, two 10 pack boxes. Cause in this one, all you get is just a guaranteed Emerald on higher historic player, I'm pretty sure. So like you can probably do better in like 30,000 more VC, 20,000 more VC that you get from saving it and doing two 10 pack boxes. So that's probably what I'll do next week for this pack opening. But I'm s I am really do wish I could have pulled this shack. I really, really badly wanted it. And it's going for 100k, which I think right now is just a little bit too much because that's the max price range. So I, I don't think I'm going to pick him up. I might if he goes down to like 60k. I definitely will if 60k, but maybe 80k. I'm not guaranteeing anything, but thank you guys for watching. My luck really wasn't that great in this pack opening. Look at all these rubies that pull, people have pulled and I didn't even have a little sighting of one, but that's okay because it can all change in one click. And thank you guys for watching. I'll catch you in the next video. Bye. My new bowl gameplay tomorrow. That's also what I had to say.